What's going on, everybody? It's your man, Harry O. Over the top, back with another video for you today. Guys, listen, before we get started, I want you guys to hit the like button. I want you to share this video. I want you to leave me a message in the comments of your experience in dealing with this or how you feel you will respond when you are confronted with this. <clears throat> So today I want to talk to you guys about excuse me how you're going to feel or how you felt the first time you saw the narcissist with someone else with the new supply or just with someone else how would you feel how did it make you feel how should you feel right the unfortunate side of this is that a lot of us have already seen it. Lots of us have already seen it. And no, it does not feel good. It does not feel good. It feels horrible, as a matter of fact. It feels like somebody is dragging you. Guys, Thing you, one thing you have to know, first of all, is that's how it should feel. Let's stop making ourselves not be normal anymore. How do you think you're supposed to feel you, the person that you have feelings for is with someone else and they're running around and they are showing it to the world like the way you felt about them meant nothing but the way they feel about this new person. Woo! One thing you have to remember is that at one time, guys, that's how they felt about you. That's what they were doing with you. They were showing the world, hey, I'm with this person now. And everything is everything and everything is this. And, you know, we're going to be this and we're going to be that. And this is what it is. So the way you feel now, usually, guys, somebody else, the person that the narc was with before you, during the time you were there, they felt the same thing you were, you're feeling as you go through it. You're proof that the narc is going to keep on. They're going to continue doing the same thing. How do you, how would I feel? <laughs> yeah, that's always the million dollar question. How would I feel seeing it? Guys, I'm going to tell you for me, I'm in a different place. It would be, it literally is laughable to me. It's laughable to me and it's laughable to me because I, I totally understand and I agree with what I saw in the narcissist. I agree with the narcissist that the narcissist is who she is. I agree with what I saw. I accept that person for exactly what that person showed me. I agree with it. And I would see, you know, the person that she was, she's with, whether it was a man or a woman. And I it would, I would told, I would laugh. I would laugh on one part. One part I kind of feel sorry for the person because I know that the person is going through hell. I know they're going through hell. I don't care what it looks like. Yeah, they could be sitting there smiling, happy. They could be feeding each other bonbons. I know that person going through hell, okay? I know that everything in public is just for show. Everything in public is just for show. Nobody's getting a pass with this narcissist, guys. Nobody. Nobody. You might think that the new supply is getting a the pass. They're not. The new supply is conducting themselves a certain way because the new supply is looking at things like, you know what? Yeah, you're right. You know, that, that that your ex, they're mad, they're jealous. They're this, and the new supply is helping the narcissist make you feel a certain type of way, make you look a certain type of way. They think that because they're helping the narcissist that they're going to have a different outcome. Guys, I'm going to tell you, I should rename this video to... 
insanity. The new supply is insane because they're doing the exact same thing that you did. Whoo! They're doing the exact same thing that you did and they're expecting a different result. The new supply is insane. Okay? They're insane. They're doing exactly what you did and they're doing more. They're thinking you just didn't love the narcissist. You just didn't give them a fair chance. You just didn't do this. You didn't cooperate. You weren't this way. You weren't that way. And they believe that they're going to have a different result because they're doing the same thing you did and they don't know it. They don't believe it. They don't believe that you came to the table and you were a good person toward that narcissist. They don't believe it. They believe the lie that the narcissist told them that you're insecure. And by no nothing that they did, when they met you, you were broken and you're just insecure. They can't get it together. They can't get you to act right. That's the story that they're telling the new supply. And the new supply believes it. If you call their phone, they'll answer the phone like, oh my gosh, like, what do you want? Why? Because they're showing off. They're putting on a show for the new supply. But what they're not showing, telling the new supply, and the new supply sitting there, they see it, they believe it, they know what's going on. But in their minds, they think that they will have a different outcome. Guys, the new supply is insane. They are insane. They believe that no matter what, no matter what they do, they believe that no matter what they do, as much as they can show the narc love, as much as they can love on the narc, that it will be different for them. And that's why I say to you, when you see the narc with the new supply, man, you listen, they getting it. Don't think for one second that they have this high quality relationship. You, you're, you're going insane if you think they have something good going on over there. If you think that they have something different going on. The narcissist is all about smoke and mirrors, okay? You saw the smoke and you saw the mirrors. Listen, guys, let's take it to the comments. You guys let me know what you think. Okay, again, I'm Harry O over the top. That's my thoughts on this. That's my experience. Again, don't hate on them because what they're doing is laughable, okay?